Woohoo! Sexy football clubs, 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 Geigen Present Style! Welcome back to Big Herb the Nerd and this episode of Geigen Present Style. This, ep uh, this series where we try and get the Gagan pressing tactic working for Liverpool and see how much we can win in a short space of time, probably one or two seasons, depending on how we go. Let's jump into the schedule though, so I can show you what's been going on because I'm a little bit happy with it. So we left you at the Tottenham game where we lost 3-2. We then went to Man City. We won 4-2 in the Carabao Cup. Used a rotated squad of sorts there. Didn't put a lot of the first team players in. But we've got quite a big squad. So, I mean, our second team is still pretty good. Goals from Mohamed Salah and Daniel Sturridge there. Then we beat Everton 3-1. Posted it on Twitter. I thought, bugger, I should have bought the Everton game. Shouldn't I? The Liverpool-Everton derby. I didn't bring it in my first season. So, I promised to bring the next, the next, uh, the second leg. The, the next, trend, whatever it is. The reverse journey. Uh, which will be at home, will be Anfield. But we beat him 3 1. We're now doing Salah and Sturridge getting goals again. Barkley getting an equal. Uh, sorry, a reply. But it was only one reply. So we won that 3 1. We then just played Bayern Munich and we won 7 2. So this is the same Bayern Munich we lost 2 1 to at home, beat him 7 2. Sturridge got two. Uh, Chan got one. Salah got two again. He's gotten a lot of goals. We're now doing got one. Lewandowski and, and Vidal put two in for Bayern, but that was nothing compared to ours. And you'll also notice, just after half-time, John Fallagan got sent off. F so we scored three goals when we were down to ten men. It was fantastic in terms of a performance. So today we take on Chelsea and Arsenal in the Premier League. Um, before we then would look to round up the Champions League group later on. But let's have a look. So we have changed some things in the tactic. I was looking, so here we are. We've gone to a 4-2-3-1. Moved away from the 4-3-3. This was mainly a change due to some players starting to come back. So, we've got Firmino came back, then got injured again. We had Oxley chamberlain We had, where is he? Lalana has come back. And I was like, hang on, we've got a lot of attacking midfielders. We've got this big hole here where we're playing either a striker or attacking midfielder. We should probably try and play both. Also, we were losing the ball in this third. And I was like, well, we've got the three defenders here. When we had Dia drop back it actually meant we weren't pushing high up the pitch and the idea being of Gagan pressing is you get the ball in this area in their half and try and score so the best way to do that is to have five players in that area um, so this is what we've gone to we've gone to the 4-2-3-1 fullbacks are on support and I've put one to close down slightly less you've then got the, the central defenders are on close down much less so they should try and keep a line on support the fullbacks will then come up and make a four across midfield with the two central midfielders when required. Eric Dia going in on the ball with midfield on defence. So if needed, he will drop in. As you can see, hit is the, the sort of minor issue here that there's a gap between our defence and our midfield. But we have a high line, so it actually shouldn't be a problem. We then have Emre Chan on the box-to-box -box midfielder role. That does cause us a problem with Wijnaldum because he's an advanced playmaker. None of these roles quite suit him. So we might maybe have to train him to come up in this role. Or I think what I've actually got to do is train him as the box-to-box. -box, see if we can get him to fill in for Chan here. We then have Salah, Coutinho, Mane and Sturridge as the front four. With this mid roll on the support. Sturridge is a poacher so he's just running off the edge, um, off the shoulders of defenders. Mane bombing it down the right. And Salah or Coutinho it was out on this left hand side. Um, whilst Firmino has been injured, we've had Coutinho in here. And Salah's just been scoring goals for fun. So I can't really bring him off at the moment. He is scoring too many goals. And if we look at team instructions get these up we've gone back to attacking very fluid we're on higher we're on balance still closing down more slightly higher using the offside trap we've turned on pass into space because knowing that you've got Mane and you've got Sturridge who are just machines when it comes to bombing they're like trains unstoppable trains we want to pass into space so when we're getting the ball back we're putting the ball over the top or putting the ball up to the wing straight away as soon as we want it back and those guys are running onto it Mixed passing directness, so that seems to work. We've got run at the defence more. And like I say, closing down more. And all these ones have stayed pretty much the same. So yeah, only real change is probably passing the space, going back to very fluid and attacking. So, that's the changes. Still pretty intense. We've got training on very low to try and manage the injuries. I mean, it's working to some extent. But let's get in. 
and play this game against Chelsea. So our lineup is Carrius in goal, Moreno, Clavin, the Rogmanali, and Malo, Chan and Dier in the middle with Salah, Coutinho, Mane, and Sturridge up top. Playing against a three at the back with wing backs for um, Chelsea. So as long as we can shut down Hazard and Moses, we should be okay. I think I'm getting the hang of these team talks as well now. So you kind of do one big one, uh, pick up where you left off last time, and then you have to go in and talk to the guy. So I know that pretty much these guys played outstanding last time. So we give them an individual talk, an assertive, I want to see more of the same from you. Malo Moreno didn't have great games, but let's... Yeah, let's just go for Malo and Moreno. Talk to those. Assertive. Make a difference. Okay, look. Moreno seems... I'm getting, I'm getting greens. Building relationships with these players. Dynamics is going to be my bitch. Right, end team talk there. It seems to go on pretty well. Set opposition instructions. Something I kept forgetting to do. Um, so we want to make sure... Jordi Alba is annoying. So let's close him down. We know he's going to be a pain. Kante also runs the shop a bit. So let's put him on... Let's put him on tight marking because D is going to be in and around the middle. And then we know Hazard, he just needs to be out of the game. Let's see how that goes for now. Okay. Let's go to the tunnel interview. So this is a derby for us. Uh, Chelsea counters a derby for um, Liverpool. So let's see how we get on. The game is underway. And we need all the wins we can get in the Premier League at the moment because uh, our job is still very much on the line. I think we're still like 11th or something. We're getting there, but we're not we're not high up the league, which is where we should be. Rob magnoli has been booked. Ooh. And I just saw that piece of advice. Saying we should probably not have him flying into tackles. So let's set instructions. Ease off tackles. So I don't want him getting sent off. He's been outstanding as well. In the last game, he had Lewandowski in his pocket against Bayern. Right, first highlight, 34 minutes into the game. Jesus, Coutinho on the ball. Out to Alberto Moreno, into Salah. Uses Moreno. Can he put it in? He can. Mane at the back post. Makes it 1-0. Ah, yes. The crosses are working again on FM18. I do love them. Right, let's, let's change up this TV camera view, shall we? How do we do? Let's change it around here. Replace. Should we go back for the behind goal? TV one's a bit boring, isn't it? Reversed. Or else we do TV with... No. Let's go behind goal. I like behind goal for highlights. So Cortina picks up the ball. Plays it down to Moreno. Uses Salah. Salah oh, cuts four defenders out of the game there. And Mane at the back post. Slots it past Courtois. 1-0. Highlight here. Jordi Alba with a throw-in. Hazard on a ball. Can we close him down? Fabregas. Come on. Let's close him out. Close him out. Dia didn't get a tackle in there. Kennedy. There's enough defenders there. Oh, Eric Dia got back. Made that tackle there. Beautiful tackle there. Salah on the ball. Oh, it's pretty up. Sprawling pass. Doesn't quite make it, though. Salah. These highlights are annoying because they're going for so long. Salah. Can he put a ball in? It can. And Quartar spills. Sometimes these key highlights, they go on for about 45 seconds. And that's half-time. So we have been the dominant player in this game, which is good to see. Um, let's talk to the team. Assertive. Uh, let's go for don't get complacent out there. Yeah, that's good. Um, right, and then I do, this, do the talks on who's playing well so above sevens let's give them a little chat a little passionate i'm very happy with the way you have been playing who's playing on lower 6.7 oh, on storage so let's see. give them a little cheeky assertive you weren't bad but you can still improve look at all that green oh i'm getting good at this starts again off uh, highlight here. Moreno with a throw in. That was terrible. Chance picked up the ball though. Dia. Coutinho. Ooh. Ooh. That was close. Sturridge not having a good game. Appears to be being marked out. Oh, he's picked up a bit now. We've got Danny Ings to bring on. I mean, I wonder if we don't have to. 
You're going to have to. Sub. Come on, innings. Show us what you got. We do need to look at strikers because if Sturridge does go out injured, we haven't got any. Or I suppose we could bring Firmino in then and we can play Coutinho, Salah and Firmino then. So not too much of a problem. Possibly. And you know what? Danny Ings might come in. Get a couple of goals. That'd be nice, wouldn't it? Short free kick played. Emery Chan drills that in the bottom corner. That is 2 0. Come on, you. Come on, the cop. I don't know what the chats are for Liverpool. I apologise to Liverpool fans. You're going to have to get me in with the lingo. What a volley there from Chan, though. Right, we've got some tired legs out there. We're 2 0 up. Let's use our subs. So, Coutinho is tired. Let's bring on. Lalana, give him a run out, or do we give Ronaldo a go in that role? Let's give Ronaldo a go in that role. Diaz, oh no, we can't do that because we haven't enough players. So let's give Lalana, and then we'll bring on Ronaldo for Diaz. Switch Chan and Ronaldo around. Right, get back in the game. What have we got here? Short free kick played again to Malo. Chan, oh, it's the same one. Coutinho to Malo, Malo to Chan, Chan to the goal. 3 0. But he can smash a long range shot, can this man? Look at this short range, layoff. Chan just nails it. Absolutely nails it. Yeah, we'll still make the changes. Chelsea have had one shot on target. Looks like we finally have a tactic that's working for us. And we still managed to keep that fluid attacking, high pressing. Um, philosophies, so it's great. Here we go, look, close down from Hazard in his own box. All they've got is the long ball, and our defence now can just stay back because we've got enough players forward. It's always good. Salah on the ball now. Can he use the, the wing back? No, he's gone to Mane. Bad ball. Oh, there we go. Look at that. 3 0. Mane and Chan with two goals. What an absolute beast of a game. Passionate. Very happy with the result and the way you played. Let's give some of the guys. Chan, you, 9.3. You, absolute beast. And Mallow there. Talk to players. Passionate. Very happy with your performance, boys. Quality of possession provides victory. Lovely job there. So let's have a... Oh, look. So the next game is the Arsenal game in 14 days. Jesus. We've got two weeks. So I'll see you back in 14 days for that Arsenal game. Okay, here we are. For the Arsenal game, we are at the Emirates. And we have got some fitness issues. The central defenders are going to have to be swapped over because they're... Um, sorry, the ones that were taken out are at the in the 80s. Diaz in at 88% condition but needs to play because we don't have anyone else that can come in. Mane, Firmino's back in. But yeah, we've got some 80s. Like Wijnaldum, Salah, Coutinho, Lovren. Rognoli suspended. Not looking good fitness wise so let's hope we can you know stick it to Arsenal get some goals early and maybe take our foot off the pressure a little bit take our foot off the pressure take our foot off the gas release some pressure a little bit but let's get into the game okay so the lineup as I said Moreno Gomez Clavin Malo Chan and Deer in the middle with Lalana, Firmino Mane and Sturridge and Arsenal playing that formation we've played against before the bottom game against Chelsea three at the back with wing backs so let's talk to the team let's go for an assertive Pick up where you left off last time. Right, let's give the central defenders a little assertive. I have faith in you. Uh, Sturridge, Firmino, Mane, Lalana. I want a performance. I want to see a good performance. Deer and Chan, do what you always do, mate. Assertive. Go out and make a difference. Yeah, that'll do. That'll do. Get into the tunnel. Clavin takes the armband. Shake hands with the devil himself, Mr. Arsenal. I mean, not the devil. Right, let's get this game underway then. Oh, 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 oh. I didn't do the opposition instructions. Damn it, I forgot. Uh, Bellerin closed down. He's going to be a beast. Apparently, Theo Walcott has been good for them. Lacazette is on to watch as well, so we'll tighten mark in him. And we'll see who across the middle 
does anything for them. Confirm. First highlight looks like our highlight. Mallow with the throw in. Puts the ball in. Mane picks out Walcott. Well done, Mane. Great pass. <laughs> You've just set them up on the counter attack. Lacazette takes a long, long shot, though. What a wally. Okay, second highlight. Lalana on the ball into Firmino. Chan actually comes in and picks up Sturridge. No, they are defending with a lot of players there, aren't they? Gomez, dear. Big ball. Kamane can't make it. Ooh, we might have to watch this. They're going to play very deep. Sanchez, ooh, gets through. The save is made. Yeah, we're going to have to be careful here. Corner, then. Alexis puts the ball in. Bellerin, at the front post. Fuck's sake. Bloody set pieces. So Alexis puts the ball in. Bellerin at the front post. Tucks it away. It's no good. Walcott with a free kick in. Oh, Bellerin again at the back post. All right, a corner for Arsenal now. Right, we need to get ourselves back in this game. What is going on, boys? On the edge of the box, Walcott takes the shot, but it's blocked. No, is that a penalty? Oh, we've just given away a penalty. Come on, man. Penalties and set of pieces. What are we doing? Lacazette takes the penalty. Scores. We're 2-0 down to Arsenal. From bloody set piece and a bloody penalty. Screw your penalty. Ah, oh, like went through the goalie. Moreno and bloody Hallow, Mallow even. Oh, shocking games. Monreal again. Arsenal coming forward. Dia makes the first tackle. Can't make the second, and we've given him a corner. Oh days. We've not had a shot in the first thirty minutes. Moreno. Gives it back to Walcott. Why are you giving it back to Walcott? Right, here we go. Lalana. Lalana, what are you doing? What was that? You just booted it up to Kashoni. You twat. Oh, we've missed the header. The Clavins missed the header. Lacazette. Oh my god, it's 3 0. Firmino's off injured. How can we play, be playing such. It's like a different team. Check launches this forward. Wiltshire. Beats Clavin because he forgets to head it. He sends it across to Lacazette. It's like three touches and they've scored a goal. And Firmino's off dicking around over his ankle. How can you be injured? You've only just come back from an injury. Honestly, what's wrong with you? What is going on? Right, let's go down to control. Fluid. Team instructions. And I'll put retain position on. Just so we can see if we can get some passing back. I need it to get to half time so I can give him a bollock in. Oh my god, Moreno, did you just head that inside? It's 4 0 in 37 minutes. What an absolute retarded season we're having. Monreal puts the ball across. Right. Moreno heads the ball into Lacazette. What are you doing? Oh my god, this defence. I mean, we did swap our two centre-backs. That probably wasn't great. But Jesus Christ, they've been shit. Right, we've got to go back. Well done, Sturridge. 4-1 at half-time. This is crazy annoying. Oh, my God. Look at those. 6.3, 6.4 is right. Corner goes in. Go on, put it away. Yes, champ, it's away. 4-2 before half-time. Right, we're only two goals behind now. That is good. Firmino got an assist there as well. Let's try and get some freaking... There we go. We're playing some football now. Right, that's half-time. So we're only two goals down at half-time. That's not too bad now, but still. Took us a long enough to get there. Right, let's go for... Aggressive. Show me something else in the second half. Um, right, you guys have been just terrible. Talk to players. Passionate. Not happy with your performance. Right, let's see if that can give them some stuff. Right, you guys. Talk to players. I still have faith. John and Dia just doing the business, isn't he? Right, let's get back out there. Clavin, you tit. I mean, we did take both our centre-backs being out at once. is not great. When you're playing Arsenal. But still, four goals.
Star Trek's big block to Mane, who cannot... He didn't even try and jump for that one against Monreal. Right, Mallow is going to have to come off, because otherwise he's going to get himself sent off. Right, Lovren can come on for Clavin. Oh, I can't bring him off, because... Right, Robinson can come on. We have to leave Mallow on. So I don't have a right back. It's John Flanagan, who also is terrible. Mane's not playing very well either. Right, I'll save Mane substitution for later on. Okay, highlight. Gomez with the ball. Into Lalana. Lalana into Firmino. Can he use the wing? Oh, that was brutal. Lacazette now on the run. Into Alexis Sanchez. Oh my god, it's 5 2. What a counter by Arsenal there. Jesus. That tackle. That was a crunching tackle on Firmino. But look at that. One, two, three, five, four defenders. And Lacazette passed three of them. And then Mallow. Is that Mallow? Yeah. Of course it is. Didn't think to Mark Sanchez. No. Didn't think to Mark Sanchez. Okay. What can we do? What can we do? We've got Mane's not playing very well. We've got Salah. Salah out on the left. The Lana's not a good game. No, let's just do that for now. Come on, Salah. Salah and Stowage. I'm pinning my hopes on you two. Get us out of this in the last 30 minutes. The whole team's just playing like crap. 20 minutes left. Come on. Give us a highlight. Give us a highlight. Right, let's win this ball back then. Come on. It's supposed to be closing. Robertson back to Carius. Carius. To Lovren. Gomez. Come on, mate. We're... Lovren. Dia. Emre. Big ball. Go on, Sturridge. Sturridge one on one. Ah, Patacek makes a save. Come on, Sturridge. Right, we're going to take a risk. We're going to go back to attacking. We're going to go back to very fluid. We're also going to switch off. Retain. Let's actually go more direct. Come on, boys. Look at that defence. Oh, I've got Lovren's coming. We've got a 6.8. That's nice. Get rid of it. Get rid of it. Get rid of it. Ah! Six two. How can we have such like polar opposite results? Look at that there. We made the tackle. We just didn't clear it. Cochrane smashes it in the near post. Six two. Come on. There we go. Put a tackle in. Jesus Christ. Ah. Bellerin's got past everyone. Dio gets back. Chan. Right, come on. Salah. Emre. Big ball. Go on, Sturridge. Go on, Sturridge. Ah! 2 1 and 1. Sturridge could have scored. That would have done us a world of good. Firmino. 10 minutes ago. Firmino's just not been. Oh, Salah. Come on, mate. Firmino's been nowhere near as good as he was in the friendlies pre game. Since he's been injured, he's just come back and been tosh. I need to find the right place to play him. I need to remember never to switch both my centre backs at once as well. Sturridge. He's not scoring today, is he? Four clear cut chances that is we've had now. Sturridge has had pretty much all of them. Firmino puts the ball in. It was terrible. Lacazette like, like just got a defensive header then that sets them up on a counter attack. What's going on? What's going on? Well, we're not coming back from this now, are we? Free kick, Walcott. Don't let him score again. Gomez, Robinson, good. Go on, Sturridge. We've got another one on one. Oh, <laughs> Sturridge, mate. Oh, my God. You've got Lacazette on that side scoring a hat trick, and Sturridge has missed at least a hat trick of one on ones now. Come on, get rid. Well done, Robertson. Oh, he's done well coming in. Wow. This has been a bit of a schooling. Come on, get the tackles in. I think I can't put them on tight marking for some players because it messes with the closing down of the rest of the team. So, point remembered. But that was bull****. Aggressive. I'm far from pleased. Right. Mallow, you were s***. Gomez, you were s***. Can I shout players that are taken off? I feel like I can. 
talk to those players. That's aggressive. Not happy with your performances. Oh, Sonny Mane's demotivated, is he? Well, pay better than Mane. Man, yeah, let's give Rumpson a little chat. Very happy with your performances, guys. Lalana looks switched off. And yeah, we even played in the wrong position, I suppose. That wasn't my best team talk, was it? But we had to give him a bit of a, a bit of a rollicking. Can't have come on a live com Chelsea Arsenal beat Chelsea and then get smashed by Arsenal. Six two. That is super embarrassing. So we are in ninth. We're a game ahead though, which is not good. Oh look, Firmino's out for another four to five weeks. Thank you, game. So let's have a look at the schedule then before we go into this. So we have got Ludogrets next in the Champions Cup. Let's have a look at that group stage. We've got six points now, so we're just above Bayern. If we can beat Ludogrets, that will leave us above Bayern Munich, which means it's all in our hands to play Barcelona at the end. Obviously Barcelona and the Bayern playing again next game, so that'll be interesting. So I'll play that Ludogrets game and we'll come back for Barcelona and Stoke, Stoke at 12. I kind of fancy playing Huddersfield. It's not a lot of games. Let's do it. Huddersfield Barcelona will come back for. It's like a nice contrast of teams. So thank you very much for watching. I hope you have enjoyed. If you have, please do smash that like button and hit subscribe if you are new so you can keep up. Get that notifications for when the game and press and style drops in your uh, subscription boxes. Um, but we will leave that there. No question of the day today because I forgot to do one and prepare one. Oops. But if you do have questions, please do put them down in the comments. Also, drop in the comments if you've got any tips for getting this Gagan Preston style tactic working. Like I say, at the end of uh, the series, because we're only going to do one or two series, I will be uploading the Gagan Preston tactic to the Steam Workshop for you all to take. So once we get it in a good position, I'll be uploading it so you guys can take it and see if you can get it working for your teams. It'd be good to see if you can get it working for teams other than Liverpool as well. Be interesting but thank you very much i shall see you next time i hope you have enjoyed bye bye